Vi talar finska här. Jag kan tala svenska. Mina men Malmö. So first thing first, who are you? Yeah. Uh, my name is Martin. I'm a Swedish YouTuber. I go by the Swedish Lad, and I've been doing YouTube for 10 years. Uh, well, this is my 15th TubeCon. Uh, also, are you coming to finish the event this year? I am absolutely coming to uh, Hatvalarena. So everyone come and see him there. Uh, uh, my advice to you starting out is do what you love. Don't do what you think other people will like. Do what you love because then it will be real. It will be your passion. And whether that is gaming, you get millions of subscribers, or if it's fly fishing, you get a hundred people that always watch your videos. Doesn't matter. Do what you love. Um, it's uh, Perkele nice. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Suomi. Suomi. Suomi vai nitto Suomi. You just spin it and then no 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 you spin it spin it and then yeah just let it okay Tom Thomas will try it it's it's Manfred's yeah and, and so this is the fascination about yeah yeah fascination I don't get it I don't get it masturbation's better and you should keep it spinning they they think that's the that's, uh, just spin it and let it let it spin. Not, because it's his video. My vlogging video. Hello. It gets a thumbs down for me. <laughs> Figure something else out. <laughs> Not you, that. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Damn. I'm a pro! <laughs> wow. YouTubers, YouTubers, YouTubers. Uh, I'm on my way to the office. We're gonna have a pre-party for uh, the uh, gala tonight. Um, and I'm super tired because yesterday was a, a drainer in a good way. We are outside the venue, it's back there, and we have a really early uh, red carpet slot, so we're probably just gonna go there and just slide through and say yeah, 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 and go in. Okay, so we're here and we're getting ready for the after party next year. After party. Alright, it's happening. The best week of the year is here. Sweden Rock Festival. I'm gonna make an entire video just about Sweden Rock, but here are some little glimpses of what this is all about. I am forever searching high and low. But why does everybody tell me no? Neptune of the seas, an answer for me please. The lily of the valley doesn't know.
I lie in wait with open eyes I carry on through stormy skies I follow every course My kingdom for a horse But each time I grow old Serpent of the Nile Relieve me for a while Cast me from your spell and let me go. 20 minutes until the train leaves. I'm back at the station and Lily's over there. Nice. And there you go. I'm back home. We are in what one Instagram person has named location-wise Mulsjö City. What we're doing here is we're, um, uh, my wife, Ida, is taking pictures at a wedding tomorrow and we drove for <laughs> five hours. Two of those were actually getting through Stockholm uh, to get down here and uh, it's, uh, it's gonna be a good day tomorrow. It's fun. All right, let's get over there and uh, see people get married. The life of a wedding photographer's assistant. Copy files. While all the fun is happening in there, I don't mind. I can have fun on my own. When I was young, never needed anyone. Those days are gone. All right, it's 8.30 in the morning. We're pretty tired, <laughs> but we have a long day of driving ahead of us. We're gonna drive down about three hours to Crossbrunna to pick up some stuff for the new apartment and then drive to Stockholm. I've got a fast car, fast enough so we can drive away from Mulsjö. We've taken stuff out of our uh, cellar to bring back to Stockholm and my wife is having a family photo session, so I'm just Sitting on the dock of a bay. Pit stop, aim on. Eam stream. Eam stream. My QR code is bigger than yours. Edholt Fincher Strika. Klemma, ah! squeeze, squeeze. <laughs> It is Tuesday the uh, 20th and I'm sitting here on the new balcony. I've uh, just been painting some and I recorded some videos. Uh, I'm getting ready for exciting upcoming days. Um, we're having like a little... Uh, no, that's next week. What's happening? Oh, it's midsummer this coming weekend. <laughs> this coming weekend is midsummer. And then I will go to Paris for two days. I uh, am! And then we have a little, um, you know, gathering in our new place on the Saturday and then I get to go and see Elton John on the Sunday so very busy upcoming days and I, I love it I like it a lot I like it a lot I like it très mucho I took Spanish and French we are heading out to Justere which is one of the biggest uh, islands in the northern part of the archipelago of Stockholm uh, and it's a beautiful day most of Sweden are not having a beautiful day <laughs> most of Sweden uh, it's rainy and cloudy and shitty but we picked a good spot this year <laughs>
It is 4.45 in the morning. I'm on the train station and I'm going to the airport because I'm going to fly first to Amsterdam for five minutes and then I'm going to Paris for two days. Yeah. Oh. There's a stop in traffic. Shit. Fuck. Shit, shit, shit. So I joined a Norwegian uh, stewardess and uh, a German guy going to Helsinki uh, and we took a cab from the, the, end, the new end station and then just rushed up to the airport. All right, on va à Paris. Guten Morgen and willkommen in Amsterdam. Here we go, next flight, going to France. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome on board Air France. Je suis ici, je suis arrivé en Paris, à Charles de Gaulle Aéroport. The flight from Stockholm to Amsterdam was faster than the bus from Charlegoul to, well, that thingy over there. <sighs> Sacre bleu! And then suddenly, il fait bleu! Il fait bleu! Oh! Well, there was a lot of rain just out of nowhere. Well, from the sky, but from. Nice! This is so French. And over there we have, I think, I think it's something that's left from uh, like an exhibition uh, a while ago. I think I read about it somewhere. It's some, some iron tower that they decided not to take down. So, I don't know. It just leaves stuff up and then it's, you know, steel and stuff. So it'll rust. No buen, no buen. I mean, it's been 15 years, but I think I'm walking towards Notre Dame. Okay, so the Notre Dame apparently is an hour's walk that way, so I'm not gonna make it today because I have to get back and prepare for my thingy tonight. So, uh, Notre Dame later, maybe. Bonjour à tous. Nous donnerons la parole à euh, donc notre ami Martin Avbro. Thanks to be with us. Donc c'est ce Swedish lad en fait qui a travaillé avec notre homologue suédois. We cannot write new laws for every new platform. We need to base what we do on a certain text, which is kind of universal, as you were saying earlier. It's, you know, it's pretty much universal throughout Europe uh, and sometimes also the world. I'm the influencer right here. Over there is the company that wants to pay me money. Over there is my audience. If I go and say, I will do what you say, and I will not be honest with my audience, my audience will be mad. They will be pissed. What's the French word for irritated? Irritated. Ugh. irritated. Uh, and if I piss them off, then, you know, they won't watch my videos and then they don't want to pay me. So it's better to be honest and upfront and transparent about things. Anyone still mad about the football game? <laughs> I, was, <laughs> I was at a rock festival uh, listening to Scorpions and I put the game on at the 90th minute. And then we had like 3,000 people cheering in the middle of, um, of uh, Still Loving You. He was, quite, he, was, he was like, what's happening? And the last one, the Marshall McLuhan one. Do not change the law because you don't understand new media. Understand new media and apply the law. <laughs> Let's do language channel Swedish versus French with I should draw a break. So I had a short tour with uh, Stefan and now I'm thinking I'm gonna go and explore a little bit. Uh, on my own. Pretending he's beside me. Hmm. It's been a very exciting day. It was it was a lot of fun and very interesting to hear uh, the other speakers. I mean, even though I don't speak or understand fluent French, I could still, you know, within the context of what uh, the subject was uh, and my understanding, uh, and also I, that I got to speak uh, in front of them, and people seemed to really enjoy it um, and listen and. Several of them came up to me afterwards and said it was a really great presentation. So I'm 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 really happy. I'm pleased that I got, I managed to managed to I managed to um, do as good as I wanted. I had a good feeling. Tomorrow uh, I'm meeting up with Sophia. Uh, she's flying in, and we're um, we're hopefully gonna just have a good time uh, in Paris. On va. Well, I'm back at the Trocadero with the Eiffel Tower behind me, uh, waiting for Sofia to uh, get in here on the uh, train. Uh, 
Bienvenue à votre table. Euh, merci. 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 <laughs> so we found this place uh, near the Trocadero Rock Park, next to it, with the view of the Eiffel Tower, and I'm going to have a uh, meat with Bernays sauce. I know. <laughs> Cram that brulee. What do the friends say? Muy <laughs> bien. So Sofia is heading uptown, and I am uh, back at uh, Arc de Triomphe. Uh, I have maybe like two hours left before I need to get my butt, uh, well, from my hotel with my bag towards the airport just to be safe. It's kind of weird to see two security people checking bags and stuff at McDonald's. I was in there to have a Mac Escargot. No, I was in there to pee. And very dark clouds are coming in, so I don't know. It started raining a lot. So I went out of here pretty early just because uh, Sofia had troubles with the train, but now I'm here like it's four hours until my flight, and this is a tiny, tiny airport. It has one restaurant. One. Yeah. Alrighty, plane, on y va à la Suède. And just like that, I'm back at uh, Arlanda, Stockholm Airport. And it's 40 minutes to the next train. Pretty nice acoustics in here. Jag vill ha en egen måne Jag kan åka till Där stannar jag tills allting ordnar sig 44 hours ago I stood on this platform waiting for a train that would not take me all the way to the airport. Since then, I've been to Paris, uh, giving a lecture or a seminar or a presentation in front of a lot of people, and I had lunch with Sofia, my friend, and... Huh. Life goes ever on. <laughs>